Did you know that around the world there is a widespread practice that kills pets, livestock, wildlife and can even harm unsuspecting members of the public? We are talking about the illegal use of toxic substances like pesticides and poisoned baits to most commonly target predators and resolve human-wildlife conflicts. But far from being a solution, this is actually a serious crime. Illegal wildlife poisoning does not discriminate among species. It poisons each individual that contacts the toxic substances, often turning victims into poison baits themselves, which creates a chain of poisoning events that are very difficult to detect. This harmful practice is one of the most urgent conservation issues we face today, and vultures' biggest threat. Even though they are not typically the target, over the past 20 years, poisoning incidents killed approximately 2,300 vultures in the Balkan Peninsula. These important scavenging birds, also known as nature's cleanup crew, provide free ecosystem services that benefit the environment, wildlife and society. Several projects, like Life Revultures, are working on the comeback of vultures using targeted conservation actions and tools, including anti-poisoning dog units. Each unit consists of a handler and a detection dog team. Just like other working dogs detect drugs and explosives, specially trained anti-poison dogs can track toxic substances and carcasses with precision, whether well concealed or from far away using their superior sense of smell. Anti-poisoning dog units actively search the countryside to find and remove toxic substances, poison baits and poisoned carcasses before other animals can be exposed to them and get hurt. Their presence in villages often helps deter potential offenders due to the much increased risk of getting caught. These units also provide invaluable assistance to police investigations, since one dog handler team could cover the equivalent of around 300 agents in terms of effectiveness and speed in detecting poison, which in turn frees up agents to work on other parts of the investigation. Although dog handler units play a key role in investigations, they are only a tool and just one part of the process. We still need human resources, capabilities and continued engagement from law enforcement and other competent authorities to help combat wildlife poisoning, deter wildlife criminals and achieve convictions to secure justice for vultures, wildlife and the environment. Follow our work as we try to fight this threat head on.